there's a sort of a, a notion that we should change our behaviour to save institutions like Social Security. Uh, and like, so, oh my goodness, pension system's going bust, we've got to have people having more kids. I think we've got to work out why people aren't having more kids. And if it's a choice variable, rather than try and offer them bribes and things of that form to have more kids to save Social Security, we've got to say, how do we adjust the life course so that actually we achieve what we want to do? And I would say that comes back to the Longevity Society aim as well, because for all the, you know, all the people kick back about the positivity of my, what I'm talking about, I'm not saying it's easy. I'm just saying this is the most important thing we face as a society. And if we do not invest in these things, we're going to get the very ageing society stories we fear. And when, for the first time ever, the young and middle-aged and expect to become old, we've got to change what we do to ensure that we age better. And I, I think that's the really key thing. How do we then make the most of these longer lives rather than changing